There's this one creature that can breathe hydrogen. That's right, it doesn't need oxygen at all. But before we get into that, let's take a second to appreciate these tiny little guys. You see, most of the time when we think of animals that can survive without oxygen, we think of fish. And sure, there are plenty of fish that can live without oxygen, but they're not the only ones. There are also plenty of animals on land that don't need oxygen, like this Pompeii worm. Now, the reason why they do and need oxygen is because they use a different gas to make their bodies run, hydrogen. Hydrogen is an incredibly powerful fuel source. In fact, it has four times the energy per kilogram than the food we eat. But it's also highly flammable, so you would think that breathing hydrogen would be pretty dangerous. I mean, we use hydrogen in the process of making fuel cells, but that s only because we can't find a better fuel source that s both powerful and safe. But somehow this little worm figured it out. You see, the Pompeii worm lives near volcanoes, and since it lives so close to volcanoes, it can take advantage of all of the hydrogen that's produced from the Earth's core. The way it does this is by basically sucking up hydrogen from the soil and using it to make ATP, which is what all of our cells use for energy. Scientists have been studying this worm for years because they want to learn how the worm breathes hydrogen. They think that if they can figure out how this worm breathes hydrogen, then we could use that knowledge to help us create better batteries or even fuel cells that run on hydrogen. As for the flammability of hydrogen, it turns out that the worm's body is mostly made up of water, which acts as a natural flame retardant. So even though the worm is constantly surrounded by highly flammable hydrogen, and even though it uses hydrogen to make its body run, it's not flammable at all. Unfortunately, this little worm isn't the only creature that can breathe hydrogen. There's also this other microbe that can do it too. But the weird thing about this microbe is that it can only breathe hydrogen when it s near a volcano. But scientists have found a way to change that. By manipulating the microbe's genes, they were able to make it produce its own hydrogen. So now this microbe can live anywhere and still breathe hydrogen just like the Pompeii worm. Now these creatures may seem weird, but the fact that they can breathe hydrogen could help us out in the long run. So who knows? Maybe one day we'll be able to create devices that can breathe hydrogen like these creatures do, which would mean that we would have practically unlimited energy.